The hello everybody, welcome your faces back to another video on the rolling line. Yes indeedy, I'm back on this map again. You guys have seen this map way too many times now. Uh, but it's just my favorite map. I really, really like it. So, uh, we're gonna be playing around on this today. We're gonna get a few trains going around. We're also gonna, uh, we're gonna see some crashes, probably. Um, but yeah, I wanna try and attempt, possibly, uh, the longest train that we can. So we've already started with this, uh, right here. So we got from all the way back here, uh, this little car right here, all the way around, all the way around, up to these three locomotives right here. So I was thinking, why don't we get another locomotive? And plop it right at the back. Okay, there we go, right in the middle. We'll go ahead and get another one, so it's span around. There we go, like that's the back of the train. But it's not the back of the train because we got more. Yeah, there we go, we'll go ahead and grab some of these. And we'll have like a million things on the back of this. There we go, look at that, that's cool. Uh, we'll go ahead and get some containers as well because they look awesome sauce. There we go, and we'll try and make it as long as we possibly can before we let it go around, okay? Uh, but before we actually make this thing go really, really long, we're gonna go ahead and get the other trains going as well. So, let's get into it. Hey! Okie dokie, so first things first is we're gonna get rid of all of the trains in this track that don't... Uh, that don't actually like take part in uh, that train right there So we're gonna make these ones go around the track at 2.3 miles an hour or 2.3 speeds because I don't know what kind of speed this is Or how that's even worked out. How is that worked out? I don't know right Okay, we're gonna make this big boy go around as well at 2.3 speeds. That's completely fine uh, We need to like stay in them until they get up to max speed, which is really annoying actually uh, but hopefully they'll get they'll all get up to max speed uh, relatively quickly uh, This one now the uh, little blue one will make this one go around at the same speed as everybody else And um, there's a there's a steam locomotive on the other track as well that we need to get going too uh, Which is completely fine. We'll go ahead and jump inside that one and we'll get it going around nice We don't want the headlights on we do want the cab light on though and um, Yeah, 2.3 speeds and we can go ahead and jump out 2.3 speeds nice. There we go Awesome. Is there anything else that I need to make go around the track or can I just leave it as it is? I think I'm okay to leave it as it is. All right, cool. Uh, so my mission right now is to make this a really, 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 really long train. Uh, and the way we're going to do that is we're just going to use these things, uh, which are the containers, and we're going to try and make them uh, go really far. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Um, right, okay. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Attach all of this together. So that it all attaches to the train, all the way down there, which is actually really far away, but there you go. Um, boom! Okay, yeah, there's something about having really long, really, really long trains um, that does this. It just messes them up, and I don't know why. There we go. So we attach all of these together. It takes it forever to uh, figure out. Anyway, right, okay, we're going to have to start this one slowly, uh, but I also want some locomotives at the back. So we're going to get these black ones, we're going to bring it all the way to the back, and we're just going to attach it right there. Like such. There we go. Okay, good. Uh, so if we go back in here and we start going very slowly uh, so that it doesn't like mess around, okay? Because when I get outside, I don't know whether the back of this is even going to be moving. No, okay, there we go. It's slowly, slowly starting. There we go. Okay, good. See how like it goes like really glitchy and stuff? It's really weird that. It's very strange. Anyway, it is actually going around. So um, it is going around probably a little bit too slowly. So we're going to go up to max two. Two speeds, please. That would be great. There we go. We'll have the cab light on in here as well. And hopefully two speeds doesn't detach everything from the back. Because that would be really annoying. Uh, but let's have a little look, see how it is. Yeah, everything seems to be... Seems to be fine. It seems to be completely fine. As long as you start them going very slowly, um, I think they end up like sort of working out what they're doing. And start going in the right, right speed. So that's good. That is really good. Nice. I think actually part of the problem with this is how much like detail we've got on the map. There is a lot of detail here and it's a little bit laggy anyway. Um, and I guess that's part of the reason that it's not it's not so smooth. Um, the front of the, the train is very smooth though. Look at that. It's actually really smooth here. Maybe if I put more locomotives in, it'll be more smooth. But I don't know. I don't know if that's the case or not. Uh, but you can see it sort of jolts a lot. You can see? Hold on. I mean, if we just have a little look. You can see it jolting around. It's really weird. Very strange. All right, cool. Now we're up to what? How fast are we going now? Oh, oh no. This train was going a different speed to the rest of the trains. All right, there we go. We're going to try and get up to speed three. Here we go, boys. This is where it starts falling apart when we get to 2.3 speeds. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and jump out and uh, we'll see what's going on. No, it's completely fine. I mean, it's still really glitchy and stuff, but it, it, it is actually going around fine. 
Nice. What else am I going to do, boys? I want to get the police train going around. The police train is actually really cool. So let's go back. What was that? Hold on. What was that? Oh, is that? Okay, okay. It's the CSX one. So the spit, the um, the police train is not actually that far away. If we just go backwards a little bit, uh, we should be able to find it. It is right here. Here it is. Nice. Okay, so we're going to make a police train. Uh, starting with the police diesel. Okay. And we're going to pull over naughty trains. Okay. Naughty trains that are breaking the speed limit or whatever. You know, it seems like a good idea to me. We'll have a police box. Uh, that's probably going to go at the back, to be honest. There we go. And we'll have a police... Uh, one of these. There we go. Passenger car. There we go. Nice. We'll push all of this together. That's only three things, and that's completely fine. And we'll go catch the criminals. Yeah! All right, we need to be going a little bit faster. Oh, yeah. All right, cool. We're going to go and catch some criminals, boys. That's our job today. All right, let's go ahead and turn our headlights on. Yeah! All right, we're going. All right, let's go a little bit faster as well. I think the train that we're actually chasing is the uh, steam train. The small steam train. That's what we're going for. Uh, and that seems like a good idea. So, let's go get it. Where does it actually go? <laughs> I should ask that question before, but I don't know where this actually heads off to. It goes all the way through here, all the way through here. It comes out of the map. We should be getting close to it because I... Oh, there it is right there. That's what we're chasing right there, the little steam flyer. Um, and it's it's actually really far ahead. So we're going to have to catch up quickly. I think this is me coming through right here. Boom! Yeah, the popo are on their way. It's a police chase, boys. It's a police chase. Hot diggity dog. Nice. All right, cool. We might want to go a little bit quicker because at the minute we're going very slowly. Okay, so we're outside of the map at the minute, that's why we can see everywhere, but you can also see that we're catching up to the train that we're chasing. There it is right there. Uh, we're not going to be able to pull up to it this quickly, otherwise we'll end up derailing all of its cars, and that's not a good idea. Anyway, we're going to have to pull up behind it. Here we go, start slowing down. Yep, start slowing down again. Oh, oh, I've lost one. We've lost one, boys. We need to speed up. We need to catch the back of this. There we go. As soon as we caught it, we're going to have to slam on our brakes, uh, which is fine. We'll go... Wait. Wait, I can't even use these controls anymore. We can't even use those controls. Where are we? I don't know. All right, cool. Well, that police train can't actually stop the uh, fugitive. So, um, what are we going to do now? What are we going to do now? I don't know. I'll tell you guys what we are going to do, and we're going to stop that machine. So, let's get onto the track with our little police shunter, and uh, we'll get going. We'll get going. We're going to get in front of it, and we're going to try and slow it down from the front. Just like Unstoppable, but yeah, um, with a shunter instead of a, a big a big locomotive. Anyway, um, it's coming across the bridge now, so we're going to try and get to the tunnel real quick. We're going to go as fast as we can, and we're going to start to slow down. Okay, now we can't be going too slow, but we also kind of need to match its speed. So let's start going backwards at about the same speed as it. There we go. Are we even on the right track? I don't know whether we are. I think we are. I think it's going to come out of here. But it could be coming out of somewhere else. <gasps> no, it's on a different track. I think. Is it in there? It's on a different... No, wait. That's a different train. That is a different train. This is the train we're after. Okay, the big boy is fine. The big boy is fine to be going. Uh, we're going to be have to go and like... Oh, no. So I want to match its speed. But um, I only want to match its speed when it's next to me. So as soon as it's close, I'm going to slam on backwards. And we're going to try and go backwards quite quickly. Okay, and that's going to be in order to, to stop this train in front. Otherwise, it might just ram me off the track, because it could totally do that. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're slowly going backwards. As soon as it gets a little bit closer, we're going to pile on the backwards. Pile on the backwards and uh, try and uh, try and stop it, okay? That's the idea. I'm trying to stop a steam locomotive with my diesel shunter. All right, here we go. It's getting very close. It's getting very close. Okay, and we're going to hit it now. We're going to hit it now. Okay, so it shouldn't be able to hit me. All right, good. We're going to practice slowing down. And speeding up again, and slowing down, and speeding up again. Oh, we're actually attached, we're actually attached. We can start to slow it down now. Yeah! Alright, there we go. We've actually stopped it really quickly there. Nice! Awesome sauce. It didn't run me off the track at all. And we have actually saved the day. Nice! Awesome. Police train for the win, boys! Now all we gotta do is we gotta sort out where it's going. So we can't leave it here, we've obviously gotta move it. Uh, where are we gonna move it to? We're gonna have to probably go into the main room right here um, Which we are on which track? I think we're on the right one Wait, no, that's not even the right way. It's not even the right way. Whoa, okay this one We'll be on this track right here. Uh, we end up going left, but we could park it all here uh, Unless this this track is used which I don't think it is 
Uh, so we're going to use that track and we're going to stop all of the stuff in here. All right, that seems like a good idea to me. Let's go ahead and head back over there, get back inside and uh, get it going. All right, cool. So we're going to have to do this backwards, which is interesting, but there you go. We're going backwards. Okay, this should be our breakout moment. We're going into the main map right now. There we go. Okay, good. We got to sort of figure out if we're going to get hit by a train or not first. That's the first thing we need to work out. Uh, then we need to work out where we're going. So we're going to be pulling in here. We're going to be going this way and we're going to be taking this line uh, back here. And we're literally just going to leave it on the back line um, because I don't think any other trains use it uh, at the minute. Although they might, mightn't they? Yes, yeah, so they were going to use it. That, in fact, this train was actually going to use that track. Um, so yeah, I don't feel bad for using it. Anyway, we're going to pull off here. We're going to stop this. So we're going to detach that right there. There we go. That train's going to stay there. That's fine. Uh, we're going to detach this one right here. Okay, we're going to have to just pick that up and drop it. There we go. Okay, cool. And uh, we'll leave all of this stuff right there. All right, nice. The shunter is actually going away, which is a little bit interesting, but there you go. All right, cool. Stop, please. Stop, please, little shunter. Thank you. That's great. All right, nice. Well, we managed to pull over a train with a shunter. Awesome. That's really cool. Anyway, boys, if you guys want to see some more of these videos, let me know in the comments down below. If you guys enjoyed the video, maybe leave a like. And if you guys want to help me get to 10k subs by the end of the year, please subscribe. That would be awesome. And if you guys can help me get to 10k subs at the end of the year, I don't know, tell your friends or something, uh, that would be great. That would be really good. Thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.